I'll just figure I'd give the uh, power light generator a bit of a tidy up before I store it. Uh, trim the additional exhaust pipe off a bit because they've just welded it onto the muffler there. I'll make up an attachable muffler for it because it's pretty loud as it is. <coughs> That's not actually a muffler, it's just a resonator. I've taken the plastic housing off and permanently attached that to a mounting flange so it can breathe. Bent the fuel tank mounting bracket back up where it's supposed to be because this was mounted horizontally before. I don't know where the fuel tank was. So it's cable tied in place for now. I've got to make or find some brackets which go from these little round pins all the way down to the bottom where there's some coach screw holes. So I'll probably end up making something for that. Shorten the fuel hose and tie it all that off. And I've just got to fix this little abomination up next. A real mess. The disconnect for all the warning LEDs which are for uh, engine temperature, oil level, other things like that. That's all been disconnected. So I don't know if this engine even has the sensors still on it, but there might be something here. And it just seems like there's charging circuit and start only. All of these sensors have been disconnected or removed, unfortunately. But the rest of it's still there and it still starts and runs fine. Mount that up there, I think. Make a new box for it. It's all heat shrunk and sealed up. There we go. Control panel's in. Still enough clearance to use the pull cord. Which does work quite well, actually. I don't mind pull starting it. But for now I want to test the electrics, make sure that's right. No problem. <laughs> I'll just have to make a bigger muffler for it. It's actually pretty loud. Oh, time for a final test before I put this away. Uh, I'm going to test a little carrier air conditioner on it. I've run that before. It works just fine. I'm going to be running heat mode on high. Let's see how it goes. Bad. I'm going to put an electronic cutoff on this as well. I've still got the solenoid that bolts on here and actuates that to kill it. it was up here somewhere. Ah, it'll show up again. Aircon works perfectly. Nice heat. 
Uh, too cold to run it in cool mode at the moment, but yeah, it's all good.